given, that's how we live it Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed I hear a lot of people talking like they politicians And choose to be an accountant because it's safe in a business Hello, hello my lovely and beautiful male friends, welcome back to a new video. So in this video we have another watch me work video. Hope you guys like the watch me work videos I make. So here you saw the previous v set she was wearing and she only wore it for one week because her own nails really grow out and they grow out in a curve and she don't like that she hates it when they grow down so she wanted a complete new set um so i took everything off and made a new complete set just to make her nails a little bit more straight so you saw her pinky nail that broke off while we were working she was lifting some boxes and the boxes slipped out of her hand taking the nail with her so it was bleeding and hurted her quite a bit so we gave that nail a couple of days of rest before I took everything off and did this set on her so I took off her complete set off camera because we all know how I take off the sets you can see that in previous videos on watch me work videos so here I'm just prepping her nails there's still a little layer of old product there because we want to secure and don't want to damage the nail it's just protection for the nail so you leave a little little layer there so I pushed back the cuticles and here I'm in with my cuticle bit and take off all of that dead skin off of her nail I'm using my Melody Susie e-file and that is my one favorite e-file at the moment and I'm giving one of those e-files away there's a giveaway video on my channel right now and when I reach 1000 followers on Instagram of on YouTube my subscribers I will be giving that e-file away and it's for US international it's just for everybody everybody can enter that video that giveaway so make sure we hit that thousand subscriber goal real soon so i can give that beauty away so here i'm just taking off the shine of her nail with a sanding band and it looks really rough and hard but this video is sped up so i'm filing in a really low in a really low speed so here I'm just f making um, uh, the nails in a nicer shape because we clipped off the rest of her nails so they look a little bit rough and busted. So here I'm just reshaping the natural nail and then I'm gonna go in with some alcohol and clean out the nail and take off all of that dust. So here I'm going in with one of my favorite nail forms and I got those from Aliexpress and they came from the Nail Pretty store and these forms are amazing. They stick to the nail really really nice. They don't leave the nail alone. I do have more forms from Aliexpress and they didn't stick as well. So these are really really amazing and they are really steady and firm so you can reshape take them off and do a lot with them and they will stay on the nail and they just don't only look pretty they do an amazing job and they are really 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 cheap so they are really really nice so you see me flip the hand a couple of times so I can see the forms are straight on her hand because you want them straight if you are going crooked here in the beginning 
you have to take everything off because you can't fix it. You want to make sure your shaping, your filing is on point to make everything neat and straight. So when everything is on, the forms and everything, we are going to prep the nails a little bit further. So we are going in with some prep to take all of the oils and everything out of the nail. And then I'm going in with my primer and they are both from a store here in Holland, the Me Too nails. And this is just my favorite prep and primer I use right now. So if anyone has suggestions for a good prep or primer, let me know because this is the one I'm currently using quite a lot. So when the prep and primer are on, you want to leave that air dry for 30 seconds. And then I'm going in with some base coat and cure that for 60 seconds in my beautiful bell lamp. And that is the lamp I use quite a lot. It really looks like the lamp from, what's, uh, oh my God, Madame Glam. It's the same white with the flower power design on there. And I really, really love the lamp. I'm using it all the time. So when that is cured for 60 seconds, we are going in with some poly gel and that's some clear poly gel I got from AliExpress. I just want to empty my tubes. So this is just a nice AliExpress I think it's Uniki's, the brand of this. And this poly gel is a little bit harder to file because it's a really smooth poly gel. It does really, is easy to move around and it will stay on your nail. It's a really nice poly gel, only with the filing it's a little bit harder. You really need a uh, 100 grit file to do something with this poly gel. So, Every time I shaped a nail with a poly gel, I'm going to cure it for 10 to 15 seconds in the lamp so it won't move when I'm doing the next nail. And when all the nails are done, I'm going to cure them in the lamp for 60 seconds so it is completely cured. And then I'm going to take off the forms and you will see me struggle to take them off because they stick really 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 good to the hand and then when i'm done with that we are going to shape these beauties and at that part i will be back so you can enjoy this part of the video be right back
so that was the part of me filing and I'm filing the side walls quite straight because I want a coughing shape nail and I'm filing the top of the nail also with ha hand file and this is a 100 grit because this <coughs> poly gel is quite smooth so it's really hard to file and if you want to take some product off you really want a harder grit file to take everything off so I'm just checking the nail constantly when I'm filing a little I'm checking the nail feeling the nail to see if everything is straight and smooth and <coughs> the shape I like and the shape she likes so I let her check her nails as well to see if she likes it I let her feel the nails to see if she feels any lumps bumps or things that are gonna irritate her because you don't want your clients to poke and, and, and do things to the nail you want everything smooth and nice so they won't mess anything up so I'm going in with my buffer file just to smooth everything out so we can put some beautiful designs on here so here is <coughs> here are the nails completely shaped and filed and really beautiful and you can leave it like this but I got some beetle gel polish and it was the Le lavender collection the purple one and danielle loves purple so we had to do this beetles gel on her nails because it's so pretty i showed it to her and she was like this is the thing we're gonna do on my nails so the beetles couldn't send it directly to me so they sent it to pumpkin's nail station the most beautiful woman in this world and she sent it to me with some extras but that video will be up of me showing this Beatles gel set swatching me and everything she sent me <coughs> so here are the colors with the pinky we did the beautiful sparkly purple one and we are doing all different colors on her nails but all pink and purple tinted and one finger we did some bling I got some beautiful bling from Catherine Ford and I love that bling so we had to do a bling nail because she said she loves bling and she really missed bling on her nails so we had to do some bling on that and until today that bling is still on she's not missing any stones so that works really really nice and in my previous videos I used some Born Pretty um, nail <coughs> glue or bling glue and it didn't work out as I hoped so here I'm using my nail bling glue from Aliexpress just the nail pretty store and that holds the bling much much better so really really like that one I do have the same bling on my own nails and they are on also a week later there's not a stone missing so <coughs> and I asked Catherine for the link for that bling I wanted in her giveaway and I wanted some more because they are so freaking cute so she gave me that link so hopefully I can put the links down below for you guys as well so what's more to tell we are going to do two layers of this beetles gel not because it's not opaque because one layer is enough but i really like just two layers the pink is a little bit opaque that needs two maybe three coats because it's a lighter color so that's why it needed more colors more layers so that's why the rest of the nails I'm just top coating and you will see the last part of the video me putting bling on her middle finger. So that was everything for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked me talking to you guys throughout the video. If there are things you want to know, if you have questions, please put the comment down below. And for now, enjoy your day, your evening or weekend. And I really hope to see you in my next video. Bye, my lovelies.
government simply how we've existed. I hear a lot of people talking like they politicians and truth to be.